Hello Leo and welcome back to my channel. I hope you guys are having a great day today. So let's see what's going on around you in love, what spirit wants you to know. Just take what resonates, leave the rest behind. Um, I feel like it's a king of swords energy is really what I'm feeling. Somebody is getting some kind of karmic justice here. We've got karma on the bottom of the deck. Ooh, underneath that is trash talking and you know what people this person whoever this is has been is toxic um they just keep talking smack about you behind your back this is somebody who doesn't stop um and i feel like uh they're gonna be locked away i feel like this person is not gonna see the light of day for a long long time i don't know what's going on here with this person and what they did but the police are coming in um, and this person's going to jail, okay? I don't know what they did, but, um, you know what, let's get, you're like over it, okay? I feel like you're, this is somebody who's hurt you in the past and you're over something. Let's see what's going on, though. Yeah, I feel like somebody's getting their karma heavy, uh, because of the trash talk and uh, whatever toxic stuff they were doing uh, towards you in the background. I feel like they had a lot of other people that they were talking to about you. Um, just slandering your name. This could be something like slander, a slander case. Some of you could be um, taking this person to court or something. But yeah, they're getting busted for something here. And I feel like this is somebody who... Um, you could be a Virgo. This is somebody who is very jealous of you. Whatever it is that they've said about you, um, it's certainly not true. Uh, this is a very virtuous person here with the Empress and the Minor Arcana. You, you're, um, you're financially stable. You're abundant. You could have a, a business going on here. You could be a boss or just like working your way up the ladder. You're putting in a lot of hard work into yourself. I feel like you're minding your own business here because the Empress and the Minor Arcana is busy, man. Really busy. Like, you don't have anything to do with this person. And that I feel like they just keep talking about you behind your back. They could be trying to ru ruin your reputation and affect your work and your abundance. I don't see that happening here, though. You've got nine pentacles. The most you can have in the deck is ten. Um, you're... Uh, you're committed to whatever it is that you're growing here. You're reliable. You're responsible. You're dedicated. You're smart. Um, yeah, and I feel like this person's just, uh, they've been jealous of your glow up, basically. I feel like this person's going to jail. They could go to jail for up to three months, three years. Clarify the police for me, please, for the collective. They could have made some kind of bad investment, too, here. I feel like it's um, something that they're... I feel like it's uh, they're getting their sentencing here, is the feeling that I'm getting. I'm seeing this as a judge here. They're getting their sentencing. And they're going to jail. There's police involved in this somehow. Yeah, for some kind of betrayal, some kind of sabotage, slander, something. You may even be starting a court case on this person for the things that they've said about you or any kind of damages that have incurred um, with your business. Yeah, look, this person's going to jail. I'm telling you. They're going to jail. They could uh, they could be going to jail for something that, you know, a way that they made their money. Okay? And it could be up to like three years. They're, I feel like this person may be getting like a three-year sentence. They've, they've caused a lot of fighting, a lot of strife. There could be a lot of people that are going, um, like turning on them. And um, I feel like they're... They're talking about them in, like, court, right? Um, I feel like they're uh, testifying against this person now. Possibly to try to save themselves. Yeah, this may have something to do with theft. Um, it, could even, it could even be something like breaking and entering. I feel like this person may have, they could have even wanted to get you stuck and trapped. Um, what is this all about? 
Emperor energy and the Empress. Yes, they, I, there could have been two people that tried to manipulate a Queen of Cups energy here. This could even be a karmic couple. This is like a power couple, too. I feel like they tried to do something. They, they were ripping people off. These could be two scammers that became pretty um, successful just by ripping people off. And there could be a lot of people testifying against this person. Some kind of scam, some kind of bad investment, or they would get other people to invest in something. I feel like, um, yeah, there's uh, there's like a whole group of people turning on this person. They're going to testify. Like they would get people to invest in something here and then they'd walk away from, from them. I don't know. I feel like it has something to do with, uh, this could be very prominent figures out here too, you guys. People that are very well known. Um very powerful figures here either in the community or i don't know you may hear about this happening here somebody is going to jail and i'm telling you i don't i feel like they're not gonna see the light of day for a long time i feel like it's affected a lot of people i feel like these these could be scammers these could be people who are just um like fake individuals here um Taking people's money or something. Yeah, spirit walk. I feel like these people tried to get um, other people to believe in them spiritually. They could be like some kind of um, religious pair. I don't know what this is. Clarify the hangman. But somebody's going to jail. And I feel like it's, it may even have something to do with possibly this could be somebody that tried to get you to invest, okay? And you didn't. You turned, the, you turned in the opposite direction. I feel like you've got, uh, you received messages here from the divine with this bird on your hand. So you're very intuitive. You're divinely led, especially to reach this point of success. And I feel like somebody tried to get you included on a bad investment or some kind of fake there's some kind of fake power uh, investment here and you didn't go for it yeah i feel like you could sense that there were some secrets some lies people possibly working together they may may have tried to yeah i feel like they approached you with the same deal at one point and there was something that just didn't feel right about it collective like their approach was good and they tried to make you feel at ease about things, but there was something that wasn't right. And now you're abundant. Yeah, see, you've, you've got divine protection here. You've got divine protection. I feel like you're, I feel like it was a business deal or something like that, some kind of investment or business idea. And you're like, you know what? No, man, I've been through a lot. I'm going it alone, right? This is the queen of wands. She's, She's comfortable just doing her. Uh, she's in control of her own thing. And this is you um, being single, working on something that's becoming very financially stable. Man, I'm telling you, the divine warned you about something here, collective. And it just completely missed you. Um, and now this person, you didn't get wrapped up in it. They're going to jail. They're going to jail. Um, like they would get people to invest in something and then they would just, you know, every time they offered a cup, it, it turned out being empty. This was like a scam. It was, it, it, that's what it feels like to me. And you didn't fall for it. Okay. Good job. So I feel like you're safe. You are so divinely protected right now with the temperance angel and the lover's card. Um, I feel like there's a person here, though, that it's almost like they don't know what to do. They're working with somebody else, um, an emperor, an empress. This could have made them very financially 
stable, but now it's like they're going to lose everything. Uh, I feel like they both could be going to jail. The police have been alerted and they're going to jail. The lies, the manipulation, and the theft. I feel like that this is a scam for money. Yeah, man, look, they're going to lose everything. Justice, the tower, this person's going to jail. I feel like both of them are, both of them, both of them. And everything is going to come out into light. This is, this should be, or this could be something that goes public. So you could even see or hear about this on the news or in your community. I feel like it's going to be public. And I feel like they're slamming the door on this person. Yeah, this is the authorities here. I feel like that, yeah, there's a team, there's a duo, the um, emperor and the empress and the king of swords and the queen of swords. Both of them, I feel, are going to jail. They're about to get their karma. And they're going to lose everything that they gained from any kind of scamming or whatever this is. Oh, I feel like they know it too. They, they could have gotten like a fortune off of people. Because people would just, like, believe them, give them their money. You know, they've built a really good, like, it's, this is like an empire. They could have even um, recruited other people to work for them in this way. They are going down. This almost feels like a whole ring going down of scammers or whatever this is. Manipulating people for money. Now they're going to be, they're going to have nothing. All of it's get, getting taken away and they're going to be going to prison or something. Yeah, this is what they're facing. Yep, they're facing this now. Yeah. Now they're crying. Okay. They weren't crying when they were um, scamming other people, but now they're crying. Now they're crying. Feel like, yeah, the police are right up on top of them, man. Yes. Yes. I feel like the police are almost like chasing this person down or trying to find them. And what does this have to do with you? I feel like the only thing it has to do with you is that you didn't believe, you didn't fall for the scam. Okay? I don't know what this has to do with my collective, but no, you look the other way. Yeah, because you're intuitive, high priestess. I can't make it up. You get messages from the divine. I feel like it's because you stay prayed up. And because of that, your foundation is solid. I'm telling you. And these people are going to be losing everything. They could lose a home. They're definitely, somebody here is facing prison or jail. I've got two jail cards. I've got the police. I've got them not seeing any daylight for a while. Yeah, I feel like these are, and these are two um, very successful, strong people. I mean, they were, uh, they were pretty successful in their scamming and manipulation tactics for a long time. Like I said, I feel like these are two that build an empire. They weren't going to stop. And I feel like they may have gotten others involved, or these are the people that are um, testifying against them in, a, in, a, in this court case. The police are right on top of this person, or these, both of them, both of them are involved in this together. Emperor, Empress, they're, they're both toxic here. All right, so what else can you show me? I feel like you're doing fine, okay? Clarify this. This could affect some children. They could have children together, or this could be somebody from your past. Yeah, I feel like whoever this empress is um, possibly has children, and they're really worried about what's going to happen to their children when they go to jail, too. They're, I feel like they're, they, both these people are going to jail. They know it. They know it. Okay. 
And I feel like they're really worried about who's going to take care of their children. So there's kids involved here. Yeah, who's going to who's going to take their kids? Wow. Wow. Um, they could, this is a masculine too, who could be thinking to themselves, why didn't I choose the collective? Um, I, I mean, I, I feel like it has more to do with um, people bringing down a, a couple of scammers here than anything. Yeah, I feel like the children, This there's a feminine energy here who's really worried about who's going to get their kids. I feel like they know they have an idea of who to who to give the children to, but that may be up to the courts. Okay, that may be up to the court system. Uh, if there's a masculine involved here, they're really wishing. Um, they're really wishing they could have another chance with you. If the, if this is your past person, I I don't know if it is or not. These two. Here are committed. This is a full-on commitment here between two toxic people. They may want to come in and apologize to you, collective, or if you, um, I feel like you're about to be gifted here with a bunch of money, so I don't know what this is. Maybe this is a, a gift to you for not, um, you know, the divine could be sending you a blessing here, a new beginning, breaking free from this person and, um, being financially stable in order to move forward because your person's down for a very long time. They're going to be down for a very long time. Um, and I feel like, yeah, you get to be happy here. You're about to get, um, you're about to have a new beginning for yourself, Collective. I don't know how you were wrapped up with this person. It doesn't really feel like a love, a love reading to me. It feels more like Man, you're being congratulated because uh, you used your intuition. You trusted in the messages from the divine when they were trying to protect you from this. Um, I see this as a, as a married couple, a toxic married couple, two of them going to jail for manipulating other people for money. That's what I'm seeing here. I don't know what your connection is to these people. The only thing I can see is that you didn't fall for it. You did not fall for it when you were approached by them. This could be somebody who tried to come back from your life, like an ex, who tried to come back and you felt weird about it. There was just something up um, and you didn't get back together with them. And because of that, you've been saved from this. Okay, so it, it could go a couple different ways here. Either way, you're about to be blessed. Okay? Because you, you stuck to your own business and you, you had faith in your intuition. Yes. And I feel like it, you didn't just, it, this says get over it, but I feel like you, um, with the arrows here, you kind of maneuvered around it, okay? And because of that, yeah, you're hitting big luck, big money, um, happiness, ten of cups, yeah, because you're not a part of this. So the divine saved you. You listened to your intuition. You went with your gut feeling. You turned away from whatever this is. And you, uh, yeah, you're not a part of it. You're safe and you're about to be blessed. Yes. Yeah, that's what I'm getting here. Let's give your advice. You may hear about these people um, getting busted and going to jail. It could actually end up being a pretty large, um, well-covered court case, like, um, I don't know, on TV or in the, in the public, like publicly. All right. What's the collective's advice? Yeah. I usually don't pick up on stuff like that, but yeah, you're going to hear about this, man. With the message in the bottle, you're going to see something, hear something about it. And I feel like you're going to be absolutely amazed. You're going to be amazed. You're going to know that this person's getting their justice, I'm telling you. You're going to know um, that you were just spared from something 
really big, actually. They could have taken a lot from you, um, and you didn't let that happen. Yeah, because you had a deep knowing. I'm telling you, you had a deep knowing. I feel like they, they, it, this could have affected everything that you had been manifesting, but you knew better. You trusted that intuition, um, and you turned away from it. Oh, my gosh, I'm so proud of you guys. All right, so what is this? Yeah, I feel like um, these people had been watching you for a long time. That's what I feel like. I feel like you were kind of a target for, for these people. Um, this could be like an establishment or something, you know. Um, you were on a major glow up. You were succeeding and becoming abundant very fast. And they were watching you to see, um, you know, when to strike. I, I feel like this, these people have been following your, your come up for a very long time. No, yeah, you still didn't believe that you didn't believe in these people. I feel like you, um, you just let this go. You, you know, you walked away from this offer, whatever it is, and you let it go. Yeah, look at this. Higher power stepped in. I'm telling you, you got your answers and you trusted in the messages that the divine was giving you and it spared you from um, a lot of hassle and losing everything that you worked for. Because there's a lot of people that they scam that can't get that back, okay? You would have lost everything, but you know what? Yeah, you took your time. You did. They, I feel like they wanted you to rush, and you didn't, okay? They wanted you to rush or think, you know, do something very quickly, and you didn't. You said, no, man, no. Mm -mm. You used your head. You didn't rush in. You thought about it. You looked at everything. It, they made it sound good. They made it sound like um, this was going to be good. But, man, you saw this going to, like, going nowhere. You, I feel like no matter how sweet they made it sound, I feel like um, you knew it was just going to, it was going to ruin all that you've created for yourself. You knew Collective, I am so proud of my collective out here. Yeah, because you meditate, you pray on it, you ask the divine. Of every step you make, I feel like you include the divine on, okay? <laughs> like every single every single decision, every everything you wonder about, you ask the divine, your spirit guides God. And they gave you this answer. They gave you the answer. And it, they protected you, Collective. I feel like you're good, but you're going to hear. You are going to hear about this. I feel like it's going to be made public somehow um, that these people are getting busted big time. And whoever they scammed are not going to be able to get that money back. Okay? They're not going to be ever be able to get back what, um, what was taken from them. So, Man, you really dodged a bullet. You did. You totally dodged a bullet here. I don't even know what else to say. You dodged a major bullet. And now because of that, you know what? You can move forward. You can be happy. Not only did you were you able to keep your abundance and your solid foundation that you've grown, but you're going to be gifted and congratulated because you listened to the divine. Oh, my gosh. Good job, collective, collective.